One thing I love about Pro Tools is the playlisting feature. It is so easy in this program to manage and store your takes and comp them. Check this out. All right, so at the very basic level, we're gonna do a recording. And if you click right here by the name, you're gonna see new playlist and duplicate playlist. All right, so if we go new, it's gonna just store that away on the track and then we can start again. And if we go to the playlist lanes here, you can see it's stored right here. We can solo it. We can even comp it. We can take the arrow here and shoot it up. So very, very useful, all right? Now, another option here is duplicate. So if we do duplicate, it's going to keep all the information on the track, but still store it away in the playlist lanes, which is very useful. Where you wanna do this over the other is basically if you're punching in audio and you don't wanna completely erase the track, you're gonna to wanna to duplicate instead of making a new playlist. But if you're doing a new take from the start of the session and you wanna just start over, new playlist is totally fine. Now, let's talk about the shortcut commands that makes it so much easier. All right, so control backslash to store a new playlist. Command control backslash to do a duplicate playlist. If you wanna do multiple tracks, you're just gonna go control option shift backslash, okay, for duplicate. Command option control shift backslash, all right? And so on and so forth. Now it gets even better. Shift up and down arrow will cycle through the different takes which is really useful. And if you wanna just cycle per selection, you can go Command Shift up and down arrow, which is really, really awesome. So as you can see in Pro Tools, it's incredibly easy to manage your takes, store them away, comp them. It is so seamless. So definitely save this video. Please like, follow, subscribe. Take care, everybody.